Hi guys, welcome to BVV Labs. Today we're looking at a couple different options for sight glasses that you have while building your extractors. So um, each sight glass is made for a different application. We have three here. We have the Metaglass sight glass. We have our borosilicate three-piece sight glass. And we have a polycarbonate sight glass. So every sight glass is compatible with a two-inch tri-clamp ferrule. Just to keep it consistent. See right here, I have three lined up. So uh, the first option you have is a gasket. You got to pick the one for your application. This one's a Buna gasket. Sight glass goes on just like this, and then you put a clamp on it. So all three sight glasses go on very similarly. Here I have a silicone gasket, and then I have this three-piece borosilicate sight glass. Now this has an optional silicone or Viton gasket to put on the inside. I'll be using the silicone for this example, as it would be a. Uh, ethanol situation that I would be doing this. Put my sight glass together and it goes on top just like that. And now I have my polycarbonate sight glass. Put it right here. Now these three options you can see they go on fairly similar. You can use the same clamps for all of them. Um, this is a low pressure clamp and I have a high pressure clamp over there as well. This goes right around the sight glass. and then you tighten it down to the proper torque spec. Leave it loose right now. I'll go back later with the torque wrench while setting up the system and make sure everything's properly tightened down. Here's another low pressure single pin clamp. And just as uh, some variety, here's a high pressure clamp. You could use either of these clamps for all three options. It's perfectly acceptable depending on your pressure application. Slide that in. Once again, as long as it's torqued down to the proper torque specs, you'll have no issues with leaking. All right, that'll do for now. So you can see here that we have three different viewing ports. They're all the same diameter, but on the uh, sight glass portion, you can see that the metal glass has the smallest window, borosilicate has the next largest, and then the polycarbonate has the largest viewing window. From the outside, it's the same thing. And then um, usually in a system, you'd want to pair these two sight glasses, put a flax line on one side, look inside the other. Um, perhaps you're boiling butane or um, watching a reaction occur. Different solvents can affect different sight glasses differently, and this is where some of the more in-depth specs come into play. For example, a polycarbonate sight glass, after um, exposed to acetone or other chemicals of that nature, it may show signs of cracking on the surface, and then eventually they get all uh, blurred up and the structural integrity will be compromised. For a silicate sight glass right here, it's uh, chemically resistant to uh, many more things than polycarbonate would be. Same with the metal glass. These two sight glasses are basically good for anything. Um, as I mentioned before, you have two different options of gaskets to pair with them. You have the Viton or the silicone, and then you have your tri gasket, which can be Buna or silicone. Now once you uh, find out what solvent you're using, it's all about pressure from there. So we have this metal glass over here is rated at 230 PSI, and this is one of the best in the industry for um, pressure specs. It's really well, really well known and uh, widely used in a lot of different industries, not just ours, for that reason. This borosilicate sight glass, this is um, made by BVV. It also has a high pressure rating and it's capable of standing up to even propane or um, other hydrocarbon pressure greater than butane. The polycarbonate sight glass has the lowest rating of the three. It's only around 225 PSI. But still at this PSI, you are able to uh, do propane mixes and stuff like that with your solvents. So um, if you have any questions about choosing sight glasses, it's always good to talk to your sales rep. They might recommend one over the other for your application. Um, for me, the borosilicate is my favorite. For the price, it's very easy to uh, you know, change out if you were to drop it and crack it. The metal glass is very expensive comparatively, so you have to be careful with them. Um, but they are very well put together. And then the uh, polycarbonate, it's not compatible with as many solvents as the other two, but it does its job pretty well for the application that we intend to for hydrocarbon extraction. 
Well guys, thanks for watching. Make sure to follow us for some more product informational videos.